Hello students, to GT Education, as we all know, partnership accounts is going on. So, in this video, we are going to do profit and loss appropriation account. At the starting of this chapter, it is very important to know about profit and loss appropriation account as when uh, we start a partnership concern uh, we record all the transactions uh, like we make tra trading and profit and loss account and balance sheet but when the profit and loss account is there the uh, net profit is calculated after that we have to make profit and loss appropriation account actually it is we can see an extension of profit and loss account where we uh, make the necessary adjustments and then make the proper division of profits or loss to the partners after the after we make the profit and loss appropriation account then we make the particular capitals or uh, current accounts of the partners so that we can show how the profit which we calculate here in profit and loss appropriation account is transferred to the particular partner's capital account. So let us see what the profit and loss appropriation account is. As uh, it is, I have already told, it is only an extension of profit and loss account. Means when the profit and loss account is maintained, after that it is an extension it is further a part of it it shows how the profits are distributed among the partners means uh, means like uh, we uh, it clearly shows that which amount of a profit or loss will be given to each partner all the adjustments of partners salary commission interest on drawings interest on capital etc are made through this account it starts with net profit or loss account transferred from profit and loss account and it, its balance shows the share of profit or loss to be transferred to partner's capital account or partner's current account. So, uh, it is basically, uh, we can say, the another part, an extension of a profit and loss account where all the basic adjustments regarding the partners are done, that is their salary is charged, their commission is charged, interest on drawings is added on the credit side or interest on capital is charged and then what the balance is left is the part of a profit or loss and we uh, transfer it to the particular capital accounts or the current accounts of the partners so let us see the basic performer of a profit and loss appropriation account here is the basic performer uh, above it the profit or loss account is made and then the uh, the we can see a smaller part of a profit and loss account known as profit and loss appropriation account is prepared in the books of a partnership concern here on the credit side first comes by profit and loss count the net profit of the partnership concern or the two profit and loss count if there is a net loss then on the credit side by interest on drawings the amount of interest charge on drawings is entered here and then on the debit side the interest on capital to reserve if any amount is particularly transferred to a reserve then it will be entered here then interest on partners loan if any partner advances as a loan the interest on that loan which is given to him will be charged here the salary of partner if the provision of providing a salary to partners is there then it will be charged on the debit side and the commission of partner if any partner is entitled to get a commission it will be charged then the balancing amount will be transferred to partners capital account that if it is a profit then it will be uh, entered here and will be uh, divided as per the profit sharing ratio or equally if anything is not told and then is di uh, divided particularly here and if there is a loss then it will be entered here and will be transferred will be divided 
as there is a profit sharing ratio in the same ratio it will be divided or if nothing is told then it will be divided equal so this is the basic performer of profit and loss appropriation account uh, first the trading and profit and loss account is prepared then the balance will, is transferred to this profit and loss appropriation account from here the balance which comes out it is uh, transfer to particular capital accounts of the partners and then the balance sheet is prepared so this is how the final accounts of a partnership concerns are done so we have we have seen this particular performer so let us do an example to make it more clear here is an example uh, we can say a b and c are the partners with capital 5 lakh 4 lakh and 3 lakh the profit sharing ratio is 3 ratio 2 ratio 1. A's salary is 12,000 per annum. B's commission is 5,000. Interest on capital is 6% per annum. Drawings were 6,000, 4,000 and 2,000 for ABC. Interest on drawings was 270, 180 and 90. And the net profit as per profit and loss account was 4 lakh. So prepare the profit and loss appropriation account. Let us check how the entries are done. Yes, the first part was uh, the uh, net profit. So net profit is on credit side. Here you can see it is 4 lakh. The another part was uh, salary was 12,000 for A. So first entry is A's salary. And then uh, B's commission was 5,000. So it is entered here and then the interest on capitals interest on capitals we can see is directly calculated at the rate of six percent on five lakh four lakh and three lakh so five lakh into uh, six percent comes out to be thirty thousand and then uh, four lakh into six percent comes out to be twenty four thousand and then three lakh into six percent comes out to be 18,000 so and the another part was drawings drawings are not entered in profit and loss appropriation account they will directly go to uh, the capital accounts of the partners or the current accounts of the partner interest on drawings that is it is 270 180 and 90 that is entered here 270 180 and 90 and now the balancing figure the balancing figure like we add all this thing and subtracted all these items a balancing figure that is the net profit comes out to be three lakh eleven thousand five hundred and forty so the capital accounts uh, it will be transferred to capital accounts for a it will be three lakh eleven thousand five hundred forty into three by six why because the ratio was three ratio two ratio one so the entry will be 3 plus 2 plus 1 that is the total of the share is 6 so for a it will be 3 by 6 for b it will be 2 by 6 and for c it will be 1 by 6 so here 3 lakh 11540 into 3 by 6 comes this share then b's share 3 lakh 11,540 into 2 by 6, 1 lakh 3,847 and C's shares 3 lakh 11,540 into 1 by 6. It is this. So the total comes out to be the same as that of credit side. So this is how very easily the profit and loss appropriation account is prepared for a partnership concern. I hope everything is clear. Please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel. Thank you.